The primary goal of the task force is to figure out all of these shortcomings, including what is available. There's so many agencies that offer respite care that people don't know about. So how do we find out about that? How do we distribute that information? How do we access that information? How do we enable people to have more um, in-home care centers, get them licensed, get them up and running? Um, what's needed? Where is it needed? I want people to know that respite care is possibly one of the most important services that we as a legislative body can ensure that people who need it have because it saves money in the long run. It allows people to stay in their homes, being taken care of by their families instead of being put in nursing homes or institutions. It allows people to, um, you know, it, sa it saves money health-wise, medical, and it's just better for the person all around. It's really a medical necessity for anybody that's taking care of somebody on a full-time basis. Determined that the bill was needed because I have a disabled son who has a brain injury and so it's a situation that we live with all of the time. We, uh, Todd had his injury in 1992 in Seattle. And since then, my husband and I have gotten away maybe three times. My husband takes care of him every day and it's, it's difficult. You know, as we've gotten older and our son is older, he's 6'5", he's a big guy and it's, it's just a lot of work. And then I talk to people who have children who are, they may be autistic, and they have high behavioral needs, and they need a break, uh, and they can't get a break. And after a while, people burn out. And what do you do with your loved one when you can't take care of them anymore? And sometimes it's just a matter of one day a week being able to go have your hair done go to the grocery store, maybe take your other children to an outing that you can't do with everybody. And it's not saying that you don't care about that person. It's just like any parent. It's a parent of a newborn baby, they need a break. Well, a parent of somebody who takes care of somebody older every single day with these high needs, they need a break.